Hey guys, <clears throat> it's Jessica from Crescent and Stampin.blogspot.com, and today I wanted to show you um, in the Silhouette Studio Designer Edition <clears throat> how you can import items from another site that you downloaded, like SVGs or cute images to print and cut. Um, I got these images from Lettering Delights, and I wanted to incorporate them into print and cut. Well, if you don't have the Studio Designer Edition, you can't do that. So I updated to it, um, I upgraded to it, and I wanted to show you how I was able to get these three images on the same page. Because if you, let's just go to a new page, let's just say we wanted to try and pull in another image. So let's go here, and let's go in my Lettering Delights, and let's go to, where is Pop School? Okay, we're going to change this to all files, okay, um, which is here, and I want to go to SVGs, and I'm going to go to number four. So if I hit OK, it'll pull it up here. Now let's say I was here. Let's do the same thing. I want it to actually go on this page. So if I go here and I go to number four, it's not going to go there. It's going to go to its own page. Okay. I don't know if that's, um, but see how I, that came in on another page, I didn't want that, I wanted it to be on my own, on my same page, so, the way you have to do it is, you're going to, um, go up to here, and you're going to, oops, sorry, another, it's something I'm working on for Disney Week, you're going to go up here, and you're going to say, import to my library, so, once again, you got to change this to all files, because otherwise it's not picking it up as a Silhouette Studio image, so I'm going to go here, I'm going to hit OK because I know it was image 4, and I'm going to rename it to Purple Marker. And hit OK. Now, I'm going to go into here, whoops, into here, and look at that. There's my purple marker, and look, I was able to get him to come into here. Now, um, if you see, if I were to come here and do cut edge, nothing happens. And the reason is because there's another step that you have to do, um, which I probably should save this for another video, but I'm going to show it all to you right now anyway. Um, down here, oh, you guys can't see that because my screen's cutting off, but in your bottom left-hand corner, you're going to see a group of dots, square dots, and if you go over it, it says ungroup selected image. So that's what you want to do, and see how I ungrouped it, and then all of a sudden my edge was there. So that's how you do that. Um, so... Um, thank you so much for watching, and please check out my blog, www.grassandstampin.blogspot.com, and I can show you uh, what I'll be doing with this. Um, it'll probably be within the next few days. Okay, guys, thanks so much for watching. Bye.